What is up everyone? So today I'm going to show you how to undervolt your MSI laptop. And for me, um, the XTU or Intel's Extreme Tuning Utility does not work. It's grayed out, so we cannot undervolt it on my system. Now, this will probably work for a lot of 2090 to 2021 laptops. So don't strike me down on that. It'll probably work the same if you do this my way. Just follow my steps. Once you reboot your PC, you want to hit delete. Just waiting on the restart here. <laughs> so once you see the logo, press delete until you're in the um, BIOS. So we just entered the BIOS. What I want you to do is press Control, Shift, Alt, and F2 simultaneously. Might take two tries. <laughs> so once you have done that, you are in the advanced menu and I want you to go down and go find overclocking performance menu. Open it, make sure your overclocking feature is set to enable. So you get this menu and enable XDU interface. Once you have done that, go to Processor and set the offset prefix to a minus, else you will be overvolting instead of undervolting. Not something you want. Now, depending on your system, you might want to tinker around with this number. For me, 60 was the best preset. Um, if I went over 60, the system would not boot. So that is an indication um, that your uh, voltage is too low or it won't boot up and you'll just go back into the BIOS. So it's pretty safe. Don't worry about it. Um, so you might have to tinker a bit around with me with this. I have a GPA 76. So if you're using the system, this is probably fine. Um, just mess around with it, depending on your system. You can easily find it out. If you boot up and it doesn't start, you get back into the menu, put it lower. That'll work. Now, if this was any helpful, hit the like button, subscribe. Let me know if you like it. That really helps me out as well. Now, once you have done all of that, save the changes and reset. Like I said, if your voltage is too low, your system will not boot. You will keep this screen and you go back straight into the BIOS. If you see the logo pop up, you're fine depending if your system does get a blue screen and you have to do it over. Now I would say for the GP76, um, voltage between, or lower voltage between 40 and 60 is more than enough. And I think for the GP66, it was like between 60 and 80. So there we have it. Also, if you're looking to update your BIOS on any um, MSI laptop, I'll put a link up here in the top. You can follow or guide it and make sure I, I also have a video about the best settings. I'll put it at the end so you can see it, you can click on it. They're really helpful. They will help you optimize your laptop and get the most out of it. Now, I'm gonna shut the video down. I hope to help you guys and I'll catch you next time. Peace out.